Dr. Jaffe, what is the difference between vitamin B6 and B12? Well, first and foremost, B complex is meant to be taken together, balanced Bs. B6 is mostly involved with what's called hydroxylation. It depends upon magnesium to be active, and it's essential. You can't live without it. B12 is not just 2B6. B12 is involved with something called methylation, which is a regulatory control aspect of biology, very fundamental. It does many beneficial things when you take it in nature's form, which is hydroxocobalamin. Hydroxocobalamin is nature's B12. There are many other forms of B12, but none is better None is safer, none is better studied, none is better understood than nature's B12, which is hydroxocobalamin. Now, if I can go back to B6 for a minute, there is a synthetic form of B6, as there's a synthetic form of most nutrients, which does not do the same as nature's B6, which is actually several different slightly different molecules. They interconvert. They form a network within biology that sustains life. So B6 is important. B12 is important. But all the B together are important. And specifically, I will mention that in 1987, we put together a formula called Perk Lifeguard, which is tabsules, everything you like about capsules and tablets, nothing you dislike. It's a unique delivery system of all active ingredients called a tabsule. And I looked at the need for B6 and B12. I didn't look at what's called the daily value or the RDA. They are very important, but they're the amounts you need to avoid deficiency. And I wanted to know, following as a student of Emmanuel Chereskin and many others, I wanted to know, what's the healthy level? What's the, quote, optimum, better, healthier level? And it was very clear back then, and it is clearer today, that you need more B6 and more B12 than you would predict from just looking at the DV, the daily value, or the RDA. I think this is a very important point to make. We want you to be healthier. We want you to be more resilient and able to repair. We want you to have more repairability and less inflammation. We want you to have healthier blood vessels, hearts, brains, intestines, digestion, metabolism. All of this is intimately related to how much available nature's B6 and nature's B12 you have. So take in nature's B6 and nature's B12, for example, part of our lifeguard, sufficient to keep your urine sunshine yellow. I'll explain that another time, but the optimum intake with food for Perk Lifeguard is to keep your urine sunshine yellow and protect your kidneys, your bladder, your body. So thanks for asking about B6 and B12. I hope you've enjoyed the uh, insights uh, and the understanding.